Bueno, empezamos el episodio 4, más espesa que el agua. Vamos allá. A ver la que se lía aquí. Por haberle ayudado al David. Previously on The Walking Dead. No! You monsters! Me ha dicho que sigue vivo el niño. Vamos a ver. Fucking Garcias. Ah, you, you. You took my goddamn guts out. No. Let's let him turn. It's only right. Joe was in on it. We did it on her orders. I'm... I'm sorry. It is too late for sorry, you backstabbing shitbag. I'll help you. I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this. <sighs> Maybe he'll be useful. Thank you. Thank you. I needed that. Come on, we have to hurry. Wait a second. David told us to come here. He's talking to the others now. Trust me, shit's about to fly. I knew I could count on you, brother. This is not over, Joan. I have friends here. Allies. Esto es antes de que pasara toda la movida. Damn it. Strike one. I'm out of practice, that's all. Yeah, same here. I haven't held a bat since the league booted me. Well, you got all afternoon to get back in your groove. Oh yeah. Just holding this thing makes me feel better. You doing okay? Uh, I've been wrestling with something. Hey! Hey, man, you're Javier Garcia, right? The ball player? Can I get your autograph? <laughs> If you could sign my baseball, that would be so awesome. Sure thing, kid. Oh, man! Thank you! Who do I make this out to? Oh, no, no, N no names. Band player's signatures are worth way more on resale than personalized crap. Just your name is fine. D don't date it or anything. <sighs> What the hell is this? You want to make money? Get a job. Ugh, whatever. You gotta keep those fans happy, big star. Let's get back to baseball. Quería vender la bola, la cabrona. Well, it's out of here. Holy cow! You just had to rub it in, didn't you? Does talking like that make you feel better? Yeah. You should try it. <sighs> Son of a bitch! Strike two. Ben. Knock that shit off. I'm serious. You just talk, talk, talk. Jeez, you gotta learn to relax, David. What do you suggest? 
Put some money on it? You know I don't do that anymore. I still can't believe you actually wanted to come here. If I were in your situation, I'd avoid batting cages forever. Well, thanks for bringing me anyway. I needed the distraction. Oh, Garcia's on fire! I think your ego's boosted plenty. Next time, we go to the shooting range. I don't really shoot. But I do. And I'm good at it. Ow! Fuck! You gotta shut up! Stupid thing. My arm's throbbing. Don't blame that on me. Gotta pay attention. Oh, the batting cage is serious business. You're about the last person who should be telling people about serious business, Hobby. I remember I showed you how to play this game. Well, let this superstar return the favor. Watch this. Garcia's hot streak is cooling. On purpose. I think I got a few more swings in me. You in? Ah, oh, David. David, what's wrong? Come back. I'm sorry, man. I was trying to keep it together. I'm not good at talking like this. What's going on? David, I, I don't understand. You don't understand because you only think about yourself. And I'm sick of it. It's been that way for years. You've always been looking out for yourself. Oh, take a breath. I'll hear you out, but this doesn't have to be an argument. I'm worried about you, man. I can't be the star's older brother anymore. I gotta go where I can be my own man. My job sucks. Kate and I fight like cats and dogs. I belong back in the army. I had a purpose there. I had respect. Last time you deployed, you didn't have kids. So, whatever you do now, you gotta put them first. I am putting them first. That's why I have to leave. Things between me and Kate have been going downhill for a while. But if I left, it seemed like that would be best for everyone. I can't keep pretending this is the life I want. Not anymore. I'm not gonna stand in your way. Well, all right then. I'm not gonna lie. If I go, it's gonna be hard on everyone. Kate may need help from time to time. You can help, right? You won't leave her hanging? I need to know that. In my mind. I'll be there for them, since you won't. If you want to go, you should go. <sighs> Thank you. I really mean it. We good? Yeah. We good. Come on. Let's get out of here. Buy your beer. Get in there. I let you go. On the road, remember? Can't you help us now? Of course I remember. It's why I haven't shot you already. That's how I'm helping you. Joan's making a huge mistake. No, you made a mistake when you tried to attack her. Hey, everybody just take a breath, all right? I was just trying to tell them. And that's your mistake right there. You can't fight everybody. Understand that Joan's not looking for revenge. She just wants order. Cooperation is the name of the game. There's still a way through this, but you've got to let Joan enforce the laws. I'll... I'll see what I can do. What, you're gonna choose that witch over me now? Better start leaning on your brother, Javi. He needs to get with the program. Creo que lo he you boys want to make it out of here. Just relax and trust in the process. This is bad. What are we gonna do? I never trusted Joan. I didn't think she'd turn on me like this. David, hey! I thought I had it handled. 
All of this is my goddamn fault. I should have seen it coming, but I dropped the ball. Big time. I'm right here with you, man. We're getting out of this. Together. Thanks. I keep doing this. Making the same stupid mistakes. Remember when you wanted to run away and re-enlist? Yeah. You talked me out of it. And you fought. To keep your family. You can do it again. Now. Listen to me carefully. I don't care what's gonna happen to me. I'm most worried about Kate and Gabe. They gotta survive. No matter what. You don't have to worry. They're safe for now. We have to get them out of town. Both of us. You're right. No matter what we do, Jones already poisoned this well. We've got to figure a way out of Richmond. All of us? All of us. This time tomorrow, we'll be together and safe. Good luck to both of us. I don't need luck. I got you. So glad to see you boys getting along. Armed escort? You're that scared to face me? Oh, David. I'm not scared of you. I came here to talk, not fight. You're not gonna be a problem, are you? I just want a calm discussion between us. You've got the guns. You set the terms. I'm glad you're willing to work with me. It's sad how we ended up here. But Clinton Lingard agree. You've become a problem. Tomorrow morning, I'm gonna call for a gathering in the square. The people deserve to hear a full explanation of your arrest. And then? Then you'll be replaced as head of security. No one's above the law, David. Not even you. I know the laws, Joan. You're the one breaking them. David deserves a fair shot. He doesn't need to be replaced. If he was as good as you say, he wouldn't be in this position, would he? You set me up. Everyone's gonna see through your lies. I did what I had to do to keep the people of Richmond safe. They're going to see that. And they'll also see that the biggest threat to them right now is you. We'll debate all of this in the morning. Right now, David, I need to ask you some questions in private. Bring him with us. Screw this. Gotta get out of here. Y la voy a abrir. Así tan fácil. Locked. I'm not getting out through here. Useful here. Hmm. I'm not going to get up there from this bench. A ver qué hay por aquí. Very sturdy. No time to rest. Well, that's about the kind of day I'm having. No sé qué es lo que va a hacer. Ah, vale, usar la tubería aquí. That's not gonna work. Ok. 
could squeeze through there. Vale, eso ya la reja. For you. Gabe? Where'd they take Dad? I don't know yet. Help me get out of here. These bars are loose. Help me pry them off. I can't do it. Can you help? Nice work, Gabe. Now, give me a hand. What's all that noise? It's a herd. They're outside the walls. This way. Come on. Kate didn't want to stay at Dad's house. Where are you taking me? Eleanor found a place. She sent me to find you. While they hide out. Is Kate doing okay? Yeah, she's fine. And Eleanor's watching her just in case. We should probably keep moving. I can't believe you found me. I looked everywhere. Oh, nice work. Thank you. They've still got your dad, though. He's gonna be okay, right? I mean, these are his people. They're just arguing, aren't they? He's negotiating with them now. You'll work it out. Let's just see what happens, okay? All clear. Come on. Kate keeps pushing us to leave. You have to make her stay. We have to stay until Dad's free. We can't leave Dad here. Not after we found him again. I'll talk to her. I'll try to convince her. Good. It's important. Hold up. gone wrong here, hasn't it? We should be safe in this town. You shouldn't be a prisoner. We'll fix it for us when we get your dad back and our family back together. Okay. That's Eleanor's place. We made it. Great. Let's get in there. close yeah this wasn't so busy before what are they up to come on let's get inside
think we could be a thing? I'm sorry. I don't know if I feel like that. That way. Look, I just don't know. It's shown me that I'm good at helping people. He's I still pissed at me? Just shut up while I'm hugging you. You know they don't want any of the rest of us like they want you. Would you be happy never seeing me again? So what about me? I wouldn't go in there if I were you. They've escalated past their same old usual argument. Never heard it this bad. That's some rough shit right there. I'm gonna try to get some shut eye. I just can't do this now. Oh, hey. Uh, hey. Trip, look who's here. Hey, guys. Uh, hey, <clears throat> where have you been? Joan threw me and David in jail, if you can believe it. Great. So you gave these people more reason to hate us. What is going on here in Richmond? You know more about this place than the rest of us. What do we do? We just can't trust Joan. She's trying to remove David from power by pinning murders on him. Told you we couldn't trust him. I'm sorry about what's going on with David, but we should have gotten out of here when we had the chance. We still need to get out of here, Javi. Let's go. There's too much unfinished business here. Javi. Sorry, we can't leave yet. Have you guys even looked out the window? Go look for yourself. Javi, even if you did get your brother free, you're not going to be able to go anywhere. Look at that. We should have left when we had a chance. Now we're stuck here. I'm sorry. I should have left with you. I think the entire world's fucked right now. It seems like we're in danger within this place and without. I, for one, would feel a whole lot safer with a few more guns to protect ourselves. That the smartest move to make right now? That's crazy. He's my brother, Kate. I have to. Okay. We have to rescue David. Damn straight we do. And we might have to face those muertos. I know where there's guns. My dad showed me. There are lots. The armory. Good idea. A small group should go. Okay. Sounds like a plan. We'll get back here as soon as we can. Good luck. Come here. Kate, I... Just be careful. Look, Javi, I, I don't know if you heard us, but I think I fucked it up with Eleanor. We can talk on the way. I, about that, I, I don't think I can leave this apartment with things like this between me and her. It's just not right. I know you must have at least heard something. I don't really want to get involved. I get that. There's not really anybody else I can talk to. I'm not sure Conrad is thinking straight right now. Just shouldn't have pushed it with her like I did. Wasn't fair. Too much going on already, right? Javi, come on! Just give us a minute, pal. I'm sorry, buddy. I just, I don't know what to do. With all that's going on here, everybody's feeling overwhelmed. Try to wait for the right time. Maybe she'll come around. <sighs> uh-huh. Right. Okay. Good luck out there. I'll talk it over with Eleanor and watch over things here. You've got my word. I won't let anything happen to anyone. Thank you. Javi, come on. Good luck.
Stay frosty, gents. What's that mean? Mike, stay cool, buddy. Looks like Bob's on duty. I'll distract him away from the door and meet you inside. Be careful in there. There might be more of them. Remember what I said about staying cool. I've done this before, Hobby. No, you haven't, Gabe. Not really. Some decisions, you make them in a split second, and then have to carry them the rest of your life. You understand? Yeah, I think I do. How can we trust Ava that she won't turn us in? Can we really trust her? I trust her enough for right now, and that's what's important. How do you know when you can trust someone? I feel like I've never really known anyone, other than you and Kate, Mariana. And what I remembered of my dad. Trustworthy people trust other people. The ones who don't trust anybody, those are the ones who screw you over. Psych 101. What's that mean? Guess it doesn't mean anything anymore. I think we're up. She sure is a big help. Veremos si no nos traiciona la la teniente O'Neill. said it'd be this way. It's down here. The guns are through that door. Locked. No time to look for a key either. to do this the hard way. Oh, eso se escucha mucho. Put these in your bag. We've never done this before. Just you and me. We make a pretty good team, right? The uncle nephew one two punch. It's not over yet. We need to keep our heads in the game. Ah, oh, you're right. Sorry to scare you. When we get back to Eleanor's, we need to talk to those people about doing the right thing by this place. I'll meet you at the entrance.
Como llevo las armas ella, bueno, lleva el otro también. Creo que íbamos a salir de aquí tan fácil. Are you sure? I'm so sorry. Yes, I'll be fine. Don't worry about it. We have to get back to the others. Jeez, I can't leave you guys alone for two minutes, can I? He's still alive? Yeah. Just passed out. Starting to think siding with you might have not been the best idea. Toss Sleeping Beauty in the closet so nobody sees him. Let me see that wound. It's really bleeding. You're gonna need that taken care of. Shit. No, it's okay. Lingard and David are close friends. We can count on him to help you. Medical facilities right nearby. It'll be quiet this time of night, too. Okay, but let's be quick. Can they really hit targets over a mile away? Not these, but some models. Javi, it's probably best if Lingard doesn't see these guns. He and David might be tight, but he's still part of Richmond's leadership council. I'll keep watch with Ava. Okay. Do any of them have laser sights? Clem? <gasps> Shit, Javi, what happened to you? Ran into a little trouble. Wow, that looks like it must have hurt. I just need to get it cleaned up. You surprised me. Thought you were someone else. Thought you'd be long gone by now. <sighs> so did I. But I still need to talk about AJ with Lingard. Look at him. Anyway, I can't leave Richmond with that herd out there. Something tells me Lingard doesn't care what you're doing. He's been out of it since I got here. He's alive. Poor dumb bastard. That's gonna need more than just cleaning, Javi. I can stitch that for you. I can't promise it'll look great once it heals. It's better than nothing, though. You've done this before? Yeah, I have. On myself, actually. In much worse conditions. You'll be fine. Huh. Let me see if I can find a needle and thread for that. Clem. Are you okay? I'm fine. I started bleeding. I know it's a Buah, thing. I've traveled with women before and, and they all had it. What is it? I mean, like, why is it... I just don't understand. It's totally normal. I mean, it's something female women have. It's, uh, what's next? It's not fun, I know that, but Kate manages. You, you'll be fine, too. Manages? How? I'm bleeding. It's supposed to happen. You'll be fine, Clem, I, I promise. Okay. I can take you back to Kate. She can help you with, uh... Javi, worry about yourself right now. We need to find a needle and thread to stitch you up first. Oh, uh, right.
Wake up. Talk to me. Dr. Lingard? Dr. Lingard. Dr. Lingard. Can you hear me? Does he look like he can hear you? <sighs> Wake up! Talk to me! Wow, that guy is really out of it. Penicillin. Not what I'm looking for. Come on, it. Jackpot. Needle and thread. All sterilized and ready to go. Cody. Hmm. Not much left. It looks like painkillers are in high demand. I wouldn't steal any medicine if I were you. It really doesn't go over well. No thanks. Here we go. <laughs> Esto para ella. Hey, this is just what you're looking for. They help you handle it. Kate will take care of you. I think I remember how to do this. <sighs> okay, hold still. Try not to breathe. Look, I know I'm probably not the best person to talk to about that stuff before. <sighs> you weren't that bad. Thanks for, you know, being here. Basically, all this means is you could become a mom, if you wanted. Funny. I already felt like a mom. Jane said I was more of a mom than she'd ever be. Como? This stinks. Literally and figuratively. Ah, this is the last of them. From here on out, we have house to ourselves. Sounds nice, right? Now we just need some disinfectant. Get that smell out of there once and for all. It'll do for now. Feels good to have a roof over our heads at least. Carver got what was coming, but just look at him. It takes a fucking monster to do that. Kenny and Carver deserved each other. Both crazy pieces of shit. No good to anyone. The world is better without them. We're all monsters now. Each in our own way. <laughs> Don't go all philosophical on me now. Even if you're right. Let's get out of here. Never want to look at that sick fuck's body again. Here, take a load off. I've got the little goofball. Hope he hasn't eaten too recently. He hasn't. Good. The last thing I need is to be covered in puke again. Don't puke on me, kid. You hear me? Remember what I taught you. Sweep and stab.
too close. Come on, we can get out this way. You know, I was pretty worried about you back there. But I guess I didn't need to be. You had things handled. Like usual. That's because I learned from the best. I'm glad you're okay. If only Rebecca could see you two together. You guys don't even need me. They just get in the way. You're more than capable on your own. You proved that back there. You're family. We're all family. Rebecca would feel the same way. Thanks, Clem. Go on, take him. He wants his other mom. Thanks, Clem. We'll always have each other. As long as we have that, we'll be okay. Tres de meses más tarde ya estoy sola. Y sin el crío. Whoa there, Clem. It's just me. What the hell do you want? I'm really glad I found you. Clementine, I know this is hard. I'm so sorry about what happened with AJ. Really, I, I am. Tell me he's okay. Please. He's as good as he can be. Which isn't great. Look, it's not much, but... Here. David wanted you to have that. AJ drew it just after you... This... Thank you. You're welcome. Consider it a peace offering? We care about you. Just try to remember that even if it feels wrong, people can still be trying to do the right thing by you. Listen, it's dangerous out here, and right now, you're hurting. Whatever you do, you can't let what happened get to you. You need to keep a level head. Plan for after that. You're strong, but that won't get you far if you don't know what you're doing. Or where you're headed. Oh, I'll keep fighting. You guys gave me no other choice. It's not time for that anymore, Clem. Your focus has to be on you now. That's all you can do. For me, 
Staying alive has always been about finding people I could trust as much as they trusted me. That's what the new frontier has been. A silver lining. Made me feel worth a damn. Kept me going in the worst of times. You'll find yours. I know you will. Someone or something. I used to have Lee. You never mentioned him. He took care of me for a while. Every time I would look at AJ, I could hear him in my head, helping me, guiding me. He's still with you, you know, here. So is AJ. From the first time we met, right here, surrounded by absolute hell, you and AJ were a light in the darkness. Hope for a better world. That's who you are. Promise me you'll never lose that light. Please. It's what makes you special, Clem. It's what keeps the rest of us going. Okay, I promise. You're a tough kid. Don't change. <sighs> I should get back before anyone notices I'm gone. Remember to keep the focus on you now, Clem. And when you need a little extra support, there's an old airfield about 10 or so miles south of here. Prescott. There are good people there. I'm sure they'll help you out. I'll miss having you around, Clem. How's that out, Mario? You're going to be okay. Thanks, Ava. Good luck out there, Clem. <laughs>